call it an Airbnb for your car. Companies like Turo here have been around in Lubbock for a couple of years now, but they've never had a designated pickup and drop off location at Lubbock's Preston Smith Airport. But that could soon change with a vote from City Council later this month. Here's KLBK's Eddie Catano. I'm sure uh, you and, and many other travelers can, can agree that waiting in line and stuck at the rental car counter just to wait for a car, or in some cases, there's not even any cars available. It's, it's not a great experience. <laughs> Albert Mangahals with Turo says helping travelers avoid that hassle is what his company is all about, and they hope a vote from Lubbock City Council will soon make that possible at Princeton Smith Airport. We're super excited that we're uh, finalizing the details of our, our car sharing permit uh, with LBB, and so it's going to be exciting that it's going to be even easier uh, for guests to be able to have access to, to vehicle from local hosts there. Duro car host Travis Turner tells us he is a true car enthusiast and wanted to find a way to keep paying for the five cars that he has without having to sell them. I've got a Tesla Model 3 Performance, 0 to 60 in 3 seconds. It's a, it's a blast. I've got a, a Ford Raptor, as I mentioned, 2020. I got this King Ranch behind me 2021 loaded out. Turner say it's simple to rent a car whenever you're traveling so that way it's hassle free and you can get anywhere that you would like. All you have to do is go to the Turo app. You're going to type in your desired place, your date. It's going to generate a whole list of vehicles that you could pick from. And once you find the perfect vehicle that will be best for your needs, all you have to do is just pick up the keys and then you're ready to go. And Turner says it's not only beneficial for him, but it's also beneficial for you. Especially for the economy here in Lubbock for um, businesses to help consumers get around because otherwise they're going to stay in their hotel and stay around the hotel and that's all they're going to see. They're not going to go out there and spend money, but you give people freedom and the ability to drive around. And Turner says if city council approves having a spot at the airport specifically for tour car hosts like him. That's what people prefer. Otherwise, you'd go to, you know, Enterprise and go rent a vehicle through them. But, you know, they, you don't want to do all the paperwork. You don't want to meet the person. You just want to get off of a stressful flight, get your bag, roll, get the keys and go. Eddie Catano, KLBK News. Eddie, thank you. Tonight, the legacy of a 